India registered a major victory over Pakistan during the first phase of Operation Sindhud. This could have been possible due to indigenous capabilities. Now in a major boost to Indian military capabilities, Defense Research and Development Organization has successfully carried out flight trials of unmanned aerial vehicle launched precision guided missile V3 at the National Open Area Test Range in Kurnool of Andhra Pradesh. The missile is an enhanced version of the ULPGM V2 missile developed and delivered by DRDO earlier. The ULPGM V3 is equipped with a high definition dual channel seeker that can strike a wide variety of targets. It can be fired in planes and high altitude areas. It has day and night capabilities and two way data link to support post launch target aim point update. The missile is equipped with three modular warhead options anti armor to destroy modern age armored vehicles, equipped with rolled homogeneous armor with explosive reactive armor, penetration come blast warhead with anti bunker application, and pre fragmentation warhead with high lethality zone. The missile is jointly developed by DRDO Laboratories, Research Center MRL, DRDL, TBRL, HMRL, Integrated Test Range, and Defense Electronic Research Laboratory. The present trials were carried out for the anti armor configuration. The missile was released from a UAV, which is indigenously developed by Bangalore based Indian startup New Space Research Technologies. DRDO is actively pursuing integration of ULPGM weapons with long-range and high-endurance UAVs from several other Indian companies. Development come production partners, Adani Defense and Bharat Dynamics Limited, Hyderabad, and 30 MSMEs startups contributed to making this unique project a grand success. Raksha Mantri Rajnath Singh has congratulated DRDO and the industry partners, DCPPs, MSMEs, and startups for the development and successful trials of ULPGM V3 system he termed the success as a proof that the Indian industry is now ready to absorb and produce critical defense technologies. Secretary, Department of Defense, R&D, and Chairman DRDO, Dr. Samir V. Kamath, congratulated the teams, DCPPs, and the startups, and said that the development of such a weapon is the need of the hour. We also congratulate DRDO and its scientists. Thanks for watching National Defense. Jai Hind. Vande Matram.